So I am here to do a life update and I have not done one of these in so long. I don't, I have no idea when the last time was that I did a life update on because things have been pretty steady around here and we haven't really had much change so I haven't felt like there has been really a need to do a life update. Um, and this one's not going to be too huge either but there are a couple things that I wanted to update you guys on and I've had some questions from some of you guys so I wanted to answer some of those. Um, so first of all, the first life update is Kaden. I know I mentioned this in my um, vlogs, but Kaden starts preschool this September, which is crazy. Like my little baby boy, my like little tiny seven pound boy is going to be going to preschool. That's just, I cannot believe that time has gone by this fast. Yeah, he starts preschool in September. He's going to be going three days a week. Um, it's Each day is only like three hours, a little less than three hours long. Um, so it's just enough time for him to go and get some social interaction and learn and be around more kids and stuff since he doesn't get a lot of that here. So he is really excited and I'm really excited. And to kind of prepare him for that, um, he has been going to the church um, daycare which is the just a three-year-old classroom. So he's been um, around that a lot. And when, when we start first started taking him to the church um, daycare, he would like scream his head off. He didn't want me and Jake to leave and he would just cry. And we felt so bad. But after, um, I think it was only like two or three times of going, um, he was totally fine. He just walked right in and he knew the teachers and just started playing and stuff and he really likes it there. He likes the little snacks that he, get, he gets there. He likes um, that he can play with Play-Doh and... <gasps> you can be in my video? This guy has been so fussy. I think he has another tooth coming in over here. He's been so fussy, just crawling around like whining. <sighs> Um, anyways, yeah, so I think he's going to be good when he starts going to preschool now that he's kind of used to um, being in an environment where me and Jake aren't right by his side every second and he gets to play with other kids and sing songs and read stories and he really likes it. Every time we'd pick him up um, from the daycare there, he would always tell me about songs that he sang and he'd always have like pictures that he colored. And so I'm really excited for him to go, and so is he. I just can't believe that he's three years old and gonna be going to preschool already. Another thing I wanted to update you guys on is that kind of where I'm at in school right now, um, since I do have two little ones, it's kind of hard to go to school full time. Um, but I do, say hi, say hi. I know I've mentioned this before, but I only have one class left, which is statistics to get my sociology degree. And that is from a community college, so it's just my associates in sociology. But I do definitely plan to finish that up. I seriously have one class left, but it's a statistics, and it's so hard. I tried taking it once, and I just did not understand it. I'm not a huge math person. So I'm hoping that I can finish that class up and finish my degree. And I'm probably going to take that class once I have more time because right now I have no free time of watching these two at home. Like I barely have time to clean the house, let alone taking a class that is like really difficult for me that I'm going to have to spend a lot of time studying on. So I'm not sure. Maybe once Caden starts to go to preschool, I'll look into it and um, think about taking it if I have a little bit of extra time. Um, it kind of depends on how easy Remy is to take care of um, when Caden's at preschool. So I plan to finish that up. Not sure what I'm going to do career-wise. I kind of decided that I'm just going to do that. I'm going to figure that out once the boys are in school because right now I'm just, my only job is being a stay-at-home mom to the boys and taking care of them and I don't really worry about anything else right now. I'm not worrying about getting a job. Um, Jake supports us on his income alone. So I'm not worried about getting a job. Um, thank God I don't have that stress on me. I'm so blessed to have that. And so, yeah, I'm just focusing on taking care of the kids at home until they start going to school, which Remy's got another three and a half years, or two and a half years to go because he's gonna be one in a couple months, huh? Wow, you gonna be one? Be one years old, huh? Yeah. I am.
am actually working on a Etsy shop. I haven't thought of a name yet, so if you have any ideas. But I'm creating an Etsy shop because I've kind of gotten into sewing lately and I, I've kind of found a niche for it and a passion for it. And I love mm -hmm. sewing like little baby things. Um, right now I'm kind of in the process of learning how to make baby moccasins. Um, oh, you got these dirty. Similar to these because I think they are so cute and I want to make like a million pair for Remy and I know um, a lot of other people love baby moccasins too because they're so cute. So I'm kind of working on that right now and getting my sewing skills down so I can start um, selling them as well as little baby yoga pants and I that I absolutely love because there's just, there's a lot of stuff that you can buy from like Carter stores and stuff but it's like not unique. It's not um customized and i just love that i love the little shops that like customize certain things for you and so that's what i'm kind of doing now as being a stay-at-home mom my only other um income is youtube which isn't really an income i don't make even close to enough to have it be an actual income from youtube but so i decided i'm gonna start up an etsy shop and YouTube is mainly um, more of a hobby to me. It's not really a job to me at all. I mean, the little perks here and there are nice, but it's really just a hobby. I love filming. I love having those videos to go back on, like every birthday or every 4th of July or every Christmas. I can just go right onto my YouTube account and go and find the video from one, two, three years ago and watch um, the past holidays and the past year is just the boys growing up and it is totally a hobby and I love, I love doing it. I love editing. Um, I need to get better at it because I keep, um, procrastinating on doing videos that I want to get done. So with my shop, with YouTube, with taking care of the boys and keeping this house clean, it is totally more than a full-time job. Half the time I don't get everything done that I want to get done. Whoa. Uh, another life update is we are kind of starting to look for a house. Um, Jake got a good promotion at work, which we are so happy and thankful about. So it has kind of given us the um, financial freedom to go and actually kind of start the housing process. We've just been looking around what kind of builders we like, what kind of style of houses we like, if we want to build or buy used, and um, making sure our credit is good and all that. We're just barely starting to look into the housing market and thinking about buying a house because we plan to be here um, a good 10, 20 years at least. So, um, yeah, that's really exciting. And our house, we just rent right now. So we're kind of wanting something that's a little bit more stable. And hopefully within the next year, maybe year and a half, but I doubt it, we will be into our own house, which is exciting because I seriously want a fenced-in backyard for these kids to go run around and play in and for Gracie to play in um, so we can get like a swing set and stuff back there because we have a yard right now, but it's not fenced in. The back is like a barbed wire, so we don't really go out and play out there. It's mainly just for Gracie to go out and kind of run around sometimes. And we use the side yard a little bit for Caden's pool, but that's about it. So I'd really like to have a big yard that I can put like a swing set in for Caden and Remy and um, just something that they can go out and play in and I don't have to like keep my eye on them 24-7, something that's safe. So that is one thing that I seriously want in a house. Um, other than that, I don't think there's any more life updates besides this little guy is about to be one years old in two months. He turns, <coughs> he turns 10 months tomorrow. Oh my gosh. He's going to be 10 months. That's insane. Um, and I don't know if you guys noticed, I got my hair cut too. So it's kind of straight. I just got the dead ends cut off and it feels so healthy and so much better. And it just feels awesome. I'm so glad I got a cut. I seriously think it's been over a year since I had my hair cut because I hadn't had a haircut since before Remington was born and he's almost 10 months. So it's been about a year since I had my hair cut. So I think that it was about time. Um, but other than that, I don't can't think of any more things to update on life-wise. Oh, wedding. One more thing. Wedding. Um, that is a huge life update. We are planning... Woo, we are starting to, like, majorly plan our wedding to have it. Um, I don't know if it's going to be next spring. It's probably going to be spring 
of 2017. I would like it to be spring of um, next year, but the fact that we're trying to get a house financially is probably not going to fit in um, to the works. So we're probably going to have a spring 2017, but we're really starting to plan. Um, I've got a friend who's um, going to be my wedding um, planner for me because I have no idea where to start. Like, I don't even know how to plan a wedding. I don't know what all is involved. So it's going to be nice to have someone that's like amazing at planning parties um, to kind of help me with like decorations and venues and photographers and cakes and all that stuff. It's just a lot and it takes a while to plan. Um, so that's another thing that's kind of in the works right now. Um, but if you guys have any more life update questions, let me know and I will talk to you guys later. Bye! Remy, say bye bye! Say bye bye! Oh.